addition and subtraction of dissimilar rational algebraic expression. We can say that it is a dissimilar rational algebraic expression if the denominators are different. So, these are some examples of rational algebraic expressions um, with different um, denominators. And there are rules that we need to take into consideration when we are dealing with adding and subtracting of the similar rational algebraic expression. The very first is to find the LCD. So as a review, you can watch the previous um, tutorial about LCD because we will be using the LCD that was sold there to add and subtract rational algebraic expressions. <clears throat> After finding the LCD, we are to change the similar rational algebraic expressions into similar rational algebraic expression using LCD. Later, we will um, determine the process, simple process only, to change the dissimilar into similar rational algebraic expressions. And after that, proceed as in adding or subtracting rational or similar rather, similar rational algebraic expression. If you did not watch the process on finding the LCD, you need to watch it because it's very important to know the process before adding and subtracting the dissimilar rational algebra expression. And at the same time, we will be using the previous results from the examples um, to add and subtract here. Adding and subtracting of dissimilar rational algebraic expression. Example number one, one fourth plus five six. So since they have different denominators, so we need to find the LCD. So you can check from the description box for the link to find the video on the process of finding the LCD. So from the from these, uh, the LCD of four and six is well. After finding that, we need to change from the similar fraction into the similar or into similar fraction so 12 over 12 next we need to divide 12 with the 4 so it will become 12 divided by 4 so the answer is 3 so we will place here 3 then, multiply it with the numerator. 3 times 1 will give you 3. Next, 12. 12 divided by 6. Next, 12 divided by 6 will give you 2. 2 times 5 will give you 10. Then, since it is already similar fraction, similar rational algebraic expression, you can immediately add it using the rule in adding similar rational algebraic expression. It will become, copy the denominator, 12. Then, 3 plus 10 will give you 13. So, therefore, the answer is 13 all over 12. Number 2 example. 5 to minus 4 third or 5 half minus 4 third so first we need to find the LCD so you can check the previous video to find the process of or finding the LCD the process of finding the LCD so from this example the 2 and 6 has an LCD of 6 so therefore it will become 6 minus 6 then same process your numerator 6 divide it by with 2 divide by 2 6 divide by 2 will give you 3 then 3 times 5 will give you 15 next 6 divided by 3 6 divided by 3 will give you 2 2 times 4 will give you 8 
So, you can immediately subtract this similar fraction using the subtracting of similar rational algebraic expression. So, therefore, equals 15 minus 8 will give you 7. Copy the denominator, 6. The answer is 7 all over 6. Number 3 example, <clears throat> 4 over 3r plus 5 over 2r squared. From the previous um, tutorial, we have defined, we have sold the LCD of 3r and 2r squared is um, 6r squared. So that's the LCD of 3r and 2r squared. Now, the same process, copy 6r squared plus over 6r squared to make it similar rational algebraic expression. Then, divide. 6r squared divided by 3r. So, as a review, um, 6r squared divide it by 3r, it will give you 6 divided by 3 will give you 2. Will give you 2. Then, since they have the same um, variable of r, so copy r. Since r squared is bigger than single r, so place it in the numerator side together with 2, then copy the exponent 2, and then the exponent of r is just simply 1. Place 1. Since they are divide division from the laws of exponent, if it is division, exponent should be subtracted. So 2 minus 1. So the final answer will be 2r. 2 minus 1 will give you 1, and it is just simply 2r. So therefore, 2r, 6r squared divided by 3r will give you 2r. And then multiply it with your numerator 4. So therefore, it will become 2r times 4 will give you 4 times 2, 8. Then copy the r. So 8r. Next, 6r squared. 6r squared, divide it by 2r squared. Divide. Okay? So, therefore, um, still use the laws of exponent. 6 divided by 2 will give you 3. So, r. So, since the value of r has the same exponent of 2, so copy r, and then the exponent 2, and then also copy 2. So, therefore, since they are in division, so subtract the exponent 2 minus 2 then simplify 3 r 2 minus 2 will give you 0 and 0 it is already no more it is already 0 so the final answer is 3 so therefore 6 r squared divide it by 2 r squared will give you simply 3 and then 3 times 5 will give you 15 so this time, add already the um, similar rational algebra expression. So copy the denominator, 6r squared, then 8r plus 15. You cannot add 15 and 8 because 8 has a variable of r. If 15 has also variable of r, that's the time you can add 8 plus 15. But since 8r has a variable and 15 has no variable r, so therefore just simply combine them. So 8r, copy the operation, plus 15. So this is the answer.